Mr. Speaker, yesterday in this House, the Associate Minister of National Defense described a flight on a search and rescue helicopter from a fishing camp as, quote, a very routine kind of endeavor indeed. Mr. Speaker, routine is taking a taxi to an airport. Routine is taking a taxi to work. I'd like to ask the Associate Minister exactly what he means by routine. How frequently does the Minister use a search and rescue helicopter to get back from vacation? The Honorable Parliamentary Secretary and the Minister of National Defense. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, the Minister of National Defense was on leave at his own expense. He was called back on very short notice, back to work. Government aircraft were used in this case for government business. Every rule, much more exigent, demanding rules uh, for the use of government aircraft were followed. And this is a government that has reduced the use of government aircraft by 80% compared to the previous government. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Okay. Honourable Member for St. John, South and Pearl. Mr. Speaker, if indeed this was the only time the minister was hoisted in a basket by a helicopter and taxied to his next destination, how in the world can this be considered routine? A minister takes a joy ride in a search and rescue helicopter, then he makes up a story, then he changes the story, then he threatens to sue the people who question him. My question today is simple, Mr. Speaker. How can the minister explain the use of a search and rescue helicopter for a personal trip? And after all of this, Mr. Speaker, how can Canadians expect to have confidence in the Minister of Defence? Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, we do not expect on this side the member opposite to show respect for the dedication of this minister to taking part in training missions, to visiting our troops when they, were, when they are on missions abroad, when they are carrying out the business of Canada. This minister has shown dedication of an exceptional quality. And in this particular case, he was on holiday. He was there at his personal expense and he was called back to work on short notice. He followed the rules, and those rules are much tougher than they've ever been in this country, Mr. Speaker.